Well, I think that this is an incredibly important movie because like myself and I think many others, we have this image of Emmett Till. Um, one is the image with him and his mother as a little boy. Another is a really deformed image of the violence that was done to him when he was uh, down south, what happened. So this, number one, fills in a story that we all need to know. So there's many other people around Emmett Till that we need to know. I play his uncle. Medgar Evers is a part of the movie. Uh, his wife as well. Um, his grandfather, his grandmother, all these different people to show where he came from and the love that surrounded him, you know what I mean? Because like I said, we just have these images and we don't have the filling of who he really was. We don't understand the story of how much Mamie Till loved her son. And out of that love, because this is a movie, it's a love story, and out of that love came her pursuit of justice to make sure the world could see what happened to him. So there's something and it's historical and it has meaning and it's formidable. This is something that we all witnessed and all went through, but we don't really fully understand. We have a memory of it. So I think this film kind of really gives you much more of an in-depth picture as to what happened, um, which I think we just can't forget. We have to keep it in our minds as we move forward in the pursuit of social justice. And I've said to other people, you know, the, the probably the most difficult thing is the tragedy of this film is that it's still relevant, right? It's really relevant, so therefore, it's contemporary, and we need to see it, and we need to address these issues. So, those are my feelings. I just felt Danielle was channeling Mamie Till Mobley. She was in touch with her on a, she was in communion with her. Um, so I think it lifted the whole film, because everyone knew, as we were working with her, opposite her, or in a scene with her, that she was going to raise the level, and we all needed to raise our levels as well. But I think one of the great things was, whatever our imaginations were about Mamie Till Mobley, Daniela brought it to life, which then made it easier for us to work within the context of our own characters in this story. So she lifted everyone. Well, you know, you want to be right. You want to do your research and kind of get a real strong sense because you're telling a truthful story and you want to give honor and grace to the characters and the story. Um, so for me, that was really important. So we did a lot of research. We were given a lot of research materials and many of us did our own research as well. Just so we can bring some specificity to what we were doing and some truth to what we were doing. So I think the delicacy is really certainly in the writing and in the story and in the direction and in the way in which we absorbed as performers, we absorbed all of the information and had constantly on our minds the role that we have to play in bringing this most important story uh, to life for a new generation. The courage of fighting for social justice, I think that'd be major because Mamie Till Mobley did things that people tried to dissuade her from doing. But she was firm in her commitment out of the love that she had for her son and pursued perhaps the path less trodden, but the results of it were the civil rights movement. Perhaps me and you wouldn't be talking without some of the efforts of what Mamie Till Mobley. So I think the idea of being courageous and pursuing social justice on all forms, whether it's for the individual, for the group, for the collective, but keeping that in mind. And I think that's what we learn from Mamie Till Mobley.